Flying high above the Tehachapi Mountains, a small plane soars past hundreds of windmills before landing at Tehachapi Municipal Airport. What better way to make an entrance? Inside the Cessna 126, an unlikely passenger. Lucky girl for sure. Diamond, a two-year-old pit bull. For the past year, Diamond has been living out of a car in Long Beach. She's had a rough life and it shows. It's got an autoimmune disease, which is potentially life-threatening. Um, she's also got demodactic mange, which is a skin condition. A woman recently took Diamond in and plotted her escape. Because Los Angeles rescues are bursting at the seams, she arranged for Diamond to be taken in by Zach Scow at Marley's Mutt's Dog Rescue in Bear Valley Springs. She's super mellow. Yeah, you are. I thought Diamond would be coming by vehicle, uh, and then we were told she was coming by helicopter. She's healthy and relaxed and exercised. Cody Pierce is the owner of a flight school in Long Beach. He's got a soft spot for rescue dogs. He has one at home. She spent half the time looking out the window and the other half the time trying to sit in the front seat. He donated his time and plane to fly Diamond 140 miles from Long Beach to Tehachapi. We would have been coming up doing a flight like this anyhow, so it was convenient for everybody. The high flying rescue made for a unique day of flight school for Nigel Tam, a student from Australia. Learning how to, you know, adjust to a new type of passenger and how to take care of her and then hopefully have make her have a good trip. It's a first experience for everything and at least I'm well prepared for the next dog trip I do. Pierce, Tam and Diamond touched down into Hatchapi this morning and met Scow at the airport. Hopefully it's a rag to rich historian. She'll find a permanent home. Without this unlikely team, Diamond could have been another dog at an overcrowded shelter, put to sleep and forgotten by now. But Diamond's story is different. Her story is just beginning.